Kowloon Wall City, 1999. I guess that's where we're supposed to be. Beneath the misty skies of China lay Kowloon, the most populous city where poverty and gang violence flourish. My favorite. I guess this is where we're actually going. However, for a young student, the first and immediate desire is to find cheap housing. That seems like some very cheap housing, which we definitely really don't want to be in, but desperate times call for desperate measures, I guess. This is a terrible idea. What awaits him inside the walls? I don't know. Gang violence? Let's be fair, it's probably death. It's, it's probably death. Alrighty, here we go, and welcome to, welcome to Kowloon. This is a horror game. My god, the sensitivity is awful, so I gotta fix that. Much better, yeah. This is a horror game based on the fictional wall city of Kowloon, which, well, not fictional, it's a fictional horror game based on the real life city of Kowloon, a walled city in China where, as you can see, it's a city so densely packed that you can barely move around, and it is full of uh, gang violence and crime. And God knows exactly why we are here. It looks absolutely terrifying, but I need me that cheap housing. We can't move past this, can we? Yes, we can. Okay. And... So densely packed, you can't even get a car in here. You have to park outside. Oh no. Now, these kind of games, I'm kind of becoming more and more off with them lately. These, like, walking sim horror games. Because, let's be fair, we probably know what's going to happen. We, we are dead. We are so beyond dead, it's not even funny. But, I am a man who likes to, you know, at least take a look at a game... If it has potential, and this game visually, it does have potential. It looks really good, really eerie, and really unsettling. So I'm all for it. I can hear the rats just like, screeing around the place, being little menaces. And we can enter this door here. So if we have a little icon on our HUD, we can actually enter, I guess. Now I don't know how long this game is. I don't know anything about it, really, outside of, uh, well, the fact that it is set in Kowloon, which, honestly, the concept of a walled city so densely packed like this actually terrifies me. I would never visit here IRL, and apparently this place is actually ungoverned, largely. I rented a room in an apartment on the fourth floor. Okay. But apparently, yeah, this place is completely almost ungoverned, like, not even authorities step in Kowloon, and the thought of that is actually haunting. So, yeah. That's a dog. Can we can we pet the dog? Too bad about the dog, he must be hungry. Yeah. Is this even the fourth floor? I I don't know. Locked. Oh, that's a lot of bags of crap. Ew, what a smell. Yeah, I can imagine. Nightclaw. Okay, they don't sound like people I want to mess with. I'm not even sure if this is the fourth floor, to be honest. I'm just going up and seeing if we end up staying alive, really. Oh, this looks like it could be it. Yeah, home sweet home. No, not home sweet home. This is a service closet. Never mind. It looks like there's actually a tally going on there, which we're not all for. We can sprint too, which is never a good sign. It means we're gonna have to run from something. Ah, maybe this is our house. Not there. Oh. Hello? God, this is so freaky. I left, I put the key in the store, it's outside by the entrance. The key in the store. It's outside by the entrance, so I guess we gotta go all the way back down? I hope that there's no one who wants to fucking kill me. Dog's awake, 
Hey, buddy. I have no food for you, sadly. I have a feeling that dog is going to be dead when we come back. Oh. This place is filthy, and there's also someone there. Hey, buddy. Nope, you're gone. Okay. I am not okay with this place. I really am not. Right, where the hell is this key to my apartment? I want to get in and get out, honestly. Entrance to the store. This is the store the landlady wrote about. Cool, yeah. He should be around here somewhere. Sounds good. We'll get the dog food. Get the boy some to eat. Uh, any keys? Ah, maybe this is the key. Cool. I mean, I guess we can feed the dog on the way. No harm in it. Oh, the music just suddenly stopped. I'm not okay with that. Okay. Let's get the fuck out of here. Go feed this dog. Hopefully the dog is okay. I'm already not liking this. Fucking hell. That was a gas pipe. Cool. Place is falling apart. You'd love to see it. Hey, buddy. Here you go. We got an achievement. Love for animals. We do love animals. They're pretty cool. Why is this blocked off now? Uh huh. I wasn't like that before, I'm pretty sure. Oh, maybe there's another way out of here. Oh, the audio is just like gone to shit. I don't like this. I really don't like this. Why did that look like a person for a second? Oh my god. Yeah, this really ultra realistic look. It just... It's fucking freaky. That's not my apartment. Ah, there it is. Alrighty, we're home. Home sweet home. It's very dark and decrepit. This is my room. Okay, we're in. Nice. I'll start by leaving my stuff on the bed. Sounds good. Why is my door open? Can't wait for a hot cup of tea. Sounds nice. Can't open that. Why is this door keep opening? I'm not okay with this. In the kitchen. Very densely populated plant-like area. Water on the floor. I don't like this. I really don't like this. This just actually screams creepy and I'm not okay with it. Yeah, well that's boiling. We can't lean. We can't crouch. All we can do is run. So I guess we're just gonna have some sequences where we gotta run. Wait a second, what was that? Looks 
time to go to my room. Yes, it is. Wait a second, that door was not open. I'm scared, I want to go home. The old woman's going crazy. I haven't even been able to go outside for a long time. Ah. Uh, we're checking the front door just in case. Sure, yeah. Oh, that's a padlock. Bathroom. Storeroom. Okay, so she's just locked the place up. Oh, hello. She has just locked the place up for safety. Yeah, that's it. Uh, hey, Miss Landlady. What's the deal with leaving for work? Like this. Door to the balcony is closed. Hmm. Oh, we have a note here. Don't you dare go out at night. I don't plan to. They find a way out. Bottles and some clothes here. I mean, I think maybe this is a bit unreasonable, you know? She just doesn't want us to get killed or something. You know, it hurts the value of the property if we get killed and all that. Oh, well, this door is open a bit. That's a dead body. That is dead body. Oh no. She really didn't do a good job hiding it. Yeah, she's a serial killer. Oh, I just noticed all the parts on here too. Hopefully she doesn't see or hear me. It's the balcony key, I think. Oh, hello. Oh my god, okay. We're not going that way. Oh, that's a body. That is a body of a person. Yeah, I think it's time we get the fuck out of here. <laughs> oh my god, Jesus Christ. Oh, okay. Oh my god. That was, that was a scare. We're locked in our room, are we? Holy shit, okay. We have all our limbs available. We're outside. Holy fuck, man. That was uh, not what I was expecting, if I'm being honest. In the apartment next door, at least, anyway. Looks like it's been locked up. 
I feel like I'm in danger here. I have to finish the renovations and move on soon. Oh no. So I guess she's in this house with me too. I keep seeing the hanging clothes and thinking they're fucking bodies. It looks like the person barricaded this door up. He didn't want anyone here. Ah, oh, another locked door. Oh no. I don't like this. Where the hell is the key out of here, man? Oh, where is it? Where is it? Where's there's a key? She's got a hope. Oh, that's not clothes. That is a fucking body. That is a body. That is a body. That's not clothes. Okay, we're getting out of here. Ah, torch. That's good. We can actually see now. Oh, is that... It's not a body? Okay, I'm confused. We got lock code here. Oh, it's a, it's a name, I think. Which, I don't know that name. Oh, no. So we gotta go find the code. Okay, so it's on these paintings, I think. Any other paintings around here? Nope, nothing here. No painting right there. Why? C is the middle one. Why is the last one? C A Y. <laughs> Fucking hell. E. E C A Y. Fuck me, man. That was actually a really good scare. E-C-A-Y, E-C-A-Y, E-C-A-Y. Fuck. Decay. That was it. Okay, cool. Let's get the fuck out of here. Crowbar. Ah, so we're gonna break the boards off the front of the door.
And that leads us back into the hallway, I think. Oh, we're trapped. Okay, of course we're trapped. I see a pair of eyes there. That's not happening. Oh, it is happening. Fuck, okay. Hello? Oh, slides on the fucking board. Of course it is. There's a way out this way. Yeah, okay, cool. Just gotta keep moving. Hopefully we don't get murdered. Gotta run, yeah, gotta run. Fucking hell, you're right. Nope, we didn't run. We got killed. Did we? Uh, yeah, we actually died. Okay, so I guess holding sprint like that wasn't enough. Oh, fucking changed. It actually changed so we didn't see the things anymore. Jesus Christ. That's well done. I like that in horror. I like that a lot, actually. Let's, uh... Alright, let's do this again, shall we? Shit gotta run. Sounds good. So we'll run this way. Run this way. Run this way. This way. And we're safe, I hope. There's no way out. Oh, great. Coat... Wait... I didn't see what that said. Code wise. Code 5293. I think. Oh, God. <laughs> Fucking hell, man. Ha. Huh. I think it said 5293. I didn't get a chance to see it well. Oh, we're out here now. I guess we're outside in the streets of Kowloon now. Yeah, I think I think we've learned our lessons. Just don't come to Kowloon. It's a terrible idea. Let's find the way out of the town. Cheap accommodation, isn't it? It's never worth it. Phone call. Looks like we need a chain thing or something? Yeah. Or a ball cutter. That's what we need. Bolt cutters. Bolt cutters. Where do we find those? There is a note in there, so I think we gotta go in there. I'm not sure. With our flashlight, at least. Uh, I guess we're going in here. Not in here, at least. Okay. Oh, this is honestly a pretty fucking spooky game. Like, I was expecting just walking sim, but uh, nah, this is, this is kind of fucking getting me, if I'm being honest. Very claustrophobic. I think like that's a major thing. 
about the turn in the games is they gotta be able to do something like claustrophobia pretty well. And this one sure does it. That's a uh, cross shaped wooden planks. I look for a lever and gasoline. Oh, we gotta repair the generator as well. Great. Okay. Came here to study, but instead we're now uh, fixing the damn thing. The elevator doesn't work, the generator's out of gas, and the starter elevator's broken. Great. And we can't check in any of these rooms. No, we cannot. In here? No. What about in here? Also, no. So we need gasoline and a star elevator, so maybe we have to head outside again. This place truly is falling apart. Alright, if I was gasoline, where would I be? This has been opened now. And we have another note here. Let me show you something. Look under the rock by the swing set. Um, honestly, don't feel comfortable doing that, but I guess if we have to find a way out, Oh, fuck off. Oh, that's not something that we wanted to see. Under the rock by the swing sets. And now into the red refrigerator. Red refrigerator. I don't like this. I 100% feel like I'm being baited, but I actually have absolutely no other option. It's a head or something, isn't it? No, it's a note. Okay. Oh, fuck off. Pine cloth in the yard. It's a body. It's 100% the body. Probably my body. For all we know, I'm dead. And, you know... Oh, this is a bunch of things to do with a kid. I don't like this. This is very unsettling. My sanctuary is beautiful, isn't it? I've been hiding out here from all the horror that was... that was starting to happen in my family in the whole, whole town. It's a good thing there's not a living soul in Kowloon anymore. You're gonna need that coin. What coin? Oh, that coin right there. So I guess everyone in Kowloon is dead or something's happened to them all. Okay, we can't go back that way. We're gonna need the coin, though. For what is the question? Is there anything else in here we're gonna need? We can't crouch or anything. So... I don't think we need to use the coin here, but we do need it later on down the road. <laughs> ah, yes. Ah, here we go. We 
Music stopped and there's someone right there in front of us. Oh no. And he's walking away. Okay. And we need the coin for the handle. Music started up again. I don't like this. The note. It's bad. My little girl ran away from home. I don't know what's wrong with her. My wife hasn't come out with the bathtub in three days. Everyone around me is crazy. I don't know what to do. This gas from the pipes. I never noticed it before. I think it's all his fault. Help. Whose fault? So maybe the gas turned everyone crazy and they kill each other? They want to evict us from our neighborhoods. The government is hiding the fact that we're dying here. Won't be surprised. And here's a canister of gasoline. Yeah, there is. Now how do we get back? Now we just come back the way we came. Maybe we do. But I don't like that sound. Something makes me think that there's something out here that wants me dead. Oh God, Jesus Christ! Let me in, please. Let me in. Let me in, please. Let me in. Oh my god! <laughs> ah! Art! On the wall. Love to see it. And now we're on the roof. Which honestly, I don't feel any safer being up here. Some chill music. That'd be nice if I wasn't being constantly spooked. Red chair. Bolt cutters. Yes, please. I just noticed that the elevator is at an angle. I don't like that at all. Jesus Christ. This Halsey screams are uh, unnerving, to say the least. I heard something to my left. What's oh, the dog? Hey, buddy. Where are you? You okay? What are you even doing here? I have a feeling that dog's evil too. Oh, there's someone up there. Hello. Oh. Everyone has gone crazy. Well, he's dead, 100%. They're all dead by the looks of it. Oh God, okay. Yeah, everyone is dead in Kowloon. Great. I kind of had a feeling that this was going to be what the outcome was. It was a ghost town or something. But, uh... Yeah. I guess I was hoping for different, but we knew it was going to happen.
I think we're out, are we? Yeah, we are. Okay, cool. Let's get the hell out of here and get to our car. And yeah, Kowloon ain't for us. It's not a nice place to stay. Even if the rent is cheap, I think I'll pass. Oh, okay. So they're presenting it the Kowloon is really just a ghost town. And a decayed hell, pretty much. And we saw what we wanted to see because of the ghosts or something. Oh, recent reports from police of people who have been to Kowloon. They say they've seen a city that does not exist. We watched five years ago by what as what was one of the worst cities in China. Now I don't think it's actually demolished IRL. I'm not sure. They experienced a spike in crime and unwarranted murders. Many believe the government was willing to terrible length to demolish Kowloon. So maybe they were suggesting the government. Oh God. Okay. Thanks. Fuck this. Oh my God. <laughs> So maybe they were suggesting the government decided to kill as many people in Kowloon as possible. But uh, yeah, that's really it, boys. That was Welcome to Kowloon. It was actually really good. Uh, I knew it was happening. I, I, I kind of actually expected this to die by the end. Or it turns out we're just a ghost reliving their um, last few memories. But the fact we managed to escape, I guess, is a nice change. Either way, though, that was actually kind of haunting. Uh, the scares were pretty on point. The atmosphere was so well done. And I just love the uh, entire idea of a real world place being turned into a fictionalized horror. But in reality, that place is just as terrifying to be in. Like I've heard and seen so many like documentaries on this damn thing. And it is a terrifying thought process to actually live in that place. And yeah, it's, it's interesting to see it brought to life in the video game. Either way, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, of course, make sure to drop a like in the video. And subscribe to the channel for more content like this. If you want to play the game yourself, there'll be a link in the description below too. Thank you all so much for watching. Welcome to Kowloon. And I'll see you in the next video. Till then, have a good one.